Hello everybody. Welcome back to Let's Play Fire Emblem, the Sacred Stones. Last time, well, we managed to make it to where Ewan's teacher was, and uh, yeah, he decided to help us on our way to Kyrpelm to get to Johanna. Unfortunately, oh wait, no, we are in Kyrpelm. He's going to help us get through the mountain pass to get to uh, Johanna. But uh, yeah. Like, on the day that we set out, we were confronted by Glenn. And, um, yeah, it was about to be a encounter of violent sorts. But he decided to let us go because he feels that there is something amiss with the Erica he knows. And the general, well, not the general, the emperor's change in attitude. And having them attack these neighboring countries. Unfortunately, he did not get to go back to ask his questions because Walter killed him. It seems like Walter just wants an endless war. Interesting indeed. Anyway, we begin chapter 12 already in progress. <laughs> Perhaps we should rest, milady. Master Sala, is it much farther? We're close. It's only half a day ahead. I would ask for a moment's rest before continuing. We are all exhausted. We can go no further today. No, Seth, I'll be fine. We must not be delayed by my weakness. Phew. Ha. Huh. I didn't realize we'd be climbing so high. Whoops. As I warned you before we set out, the footing here can be treacherous. Do you people truly live in this place? These barren crags seem unfit for human habitation. Material wealth brings strife. We've no need of these things. In this, we are of one mind with the Great Dragon. The Great Dragon? Nims ain't dragons. Nims monsters. Ah, Princess Erica, watch out. More monsters? Master Salad, do these creatures normally inhabit this region? Saleh, Saleh? That's Arabic, it's not, I, I don't know how to pronounce it. No, these things come from Darkling Woods. It's been a long time since they've wandered this far afield. It's as if the Elder, no, it's as the Elder says, evil omens take many shapes. It looks like those fiends have noticed us as well. We should move, Erica. I'm ready to fight now. This armor used to be too heavy for me to wear. But now it's no problem. I've come a long way. That's right. I'm a real soldier now. But I'm not about to stop. I'm just getting started. So we can make her a knight or a cavalier. I like I like the little hair tied back and she's on a horse and whatnot. But Team Cavalier is like already OP right now. I mean, we got Seth. Well, Seth is a paladin. Uh, but we have Franz. We have Kyle. We have Ford. Kyle and Ford are, like, really good. Franz is, like, my best unit right now. Maybe Tana, <laughs> who's, like, five levels behind. But she's frightening right now. I can have her like take a javelin to archers and she'll probably be fine and she doesn't even have like the shield that protects her from arrows but yeah we don't need another cavalier right now and i have not been too pleased with gilliam lately so we'll see what she does as a knight i wish she had a custom sprite for this Instead, she's just rocking the red armor. Oh, wow. Actually, she might end up better than him, honestly. Nine speed. She has 11. Oh, oh, wow. Eight, eight, eleven, ten. 11, 10. I mean, well, okay, he kind of, like, shits on her in terms of strength, but he's also level 14. <laughs> it took him 11 levels to get to that point. Did I get him at level 3 or level 4? I don't even remember. And her skill and speed 
like skill is almost right there. Speed surpasses him. 10, 8, 4 for luck, defense, resistance. Oh my God. So she has better luck. Her defense will get there. She's a freaking knight. And she matches him in resistance. She's already on his level. That's insanity. And also, Sala is joining us for this. He's a sage, a promoted mage. Anima, light, and staffs. He knows some good magic. He has some good stats. We don't need his assistance here. I mean, chain, wrong, wrong, wrong uh, word of phrase there, or term of phrase. I can't speak. I, I forgot the English language. He doesn't need our help, but we're gonna provide it anyway. Also, this map is looking pretty rough. New enemy types! Yay! <laughs> we got male duins, or male duins. I don't know how to pronounce that accent, Mark. Immensely fast and strong creatures who hunt with axes and bows. He ain't playing around, yo. He ain't playing around. No luck, though. And of course, we got gargoyles and slackets and more gargoyles, okay, and gargoyles and spiders and alrighty and just standard stuff. That one has a poison claw. You gotta watch out for that. Poison claw, fire fame of dudes, okay, you know, just same old, same old, you know, stuff we've dealt with before. I will not need to bring comb for this. That's good. Steel axe, and these are Tarvos. Uh, they evolve into the male dunes. Vile man beasts who thunder into combat with colossal axes. Yeah, this one's not that bad, honestly. All right, well. Like, their position is pretty rough. You know, we got a vendor right there. Some rando houses, and all righty then. Honestly? I may just... Go ahead and bring Vanessa along for this. I know I probably shouldn't because Vanessa has been really letting me down, but this mountain warfare is going to be really good. Then again, Vanessa is no Tana, and Tana has that high skill. So Tana will actually fare better in the mountains than Vanessa will. The de decisions, decisions, decisions. And before I forget, because I think I forgot from the previous chapter, Eins has supports with Garrick, Vanessa, Tana, Joshua. Really, Joshua? Huh. Larachelle and Erica. Tempted about the Larachelle ones. Um. Garrick has supports with Eins, Tethys, Marissa, Sala. Joshua and Ross. Uh, Tethys has supports with. I mean, you, you, you've seen his sprite on the map. Yeah, that, that's Ellen and Garrick, Marissa, and Arthur, and someone we haven't met yet. Um, yeah, Sala has supports with Garrick and Erica currently. Well, that was a spoiler up at the very top. Um, Marissa. Has supports with Tana. Interesting in that one. Tethys, Garrick, Joshua, and Calm. I'm also interested in her and Tethys, honestly. And Joshua. All of hers seem really interesting. Don't know if I have the patience to bring her along with Calm, though. And Larchelle has supports with Dazla, Joshua, Erica, and Eins. Dazla has supports with La Rochelle and Garcia. And three other people. All right. Cool. Item management time. All right, giving uh, Amelia the secret book. Just to raise her skill. And as for units, I mean, I would have brought loot along for this, but we got Sala here, so um, 
You're gonna be sitting this one out. I'm sorry, Loot. I am so sorry. Natasha is just gonna be sitting this out for La Rochelle, which I need to make room for. So goodbye, Calm. Get in here, girl. All right. I wanna bring Marissa along. This this feels wrong for, I mean, her strength is not as good. She won't be doing as much damage, but I don't think I'll really have to worry about that too much. So come on, Marissa. No, she's level five, like that's, she's really behind the eight ball here. Well, so let me check the map. Because we got a lot of Lance users. But also like a lot of regular monsters too. And her speed can match up with the Moth Dug, so... Like they wouldn't be able to attack twice on her. Hmm. All right, yeah, it might not be the worst idea to bring her. Um, I kind of want to let one of the other calves, like, get in some work. But Franz is close to level 20. It's just my style to get units to max level and then promote them. I don't need Garrick, honestly. Like, one or the other should be fine. But he's also good. <laughs> I could just go ahead and promote him, honestly. Now nah, we'll, 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 we'll see what happens. <laughs> I mean, I would feel bad for leaving Ross behind. But I am going to go with Team Peg for this. I I could swap out Franz for another Cav. I don't know, because... Hmm. Hey, why do I have Amelia right there? Oh, I accidentally chose the wrong one. No, yeah, you, you, you coming. Plus, Naomi is going to thrive here because of those gargoyles. Magic users in general are going to thrive, but with the mountain warfare, why not use my uh, peg knights? And yeah, she can't use a restore staff right now, which is going to come in handy for the uh, only range of one, really? All right. It's going to come in handy for the poison, but she's probably going to use the staff enough to raise her weapon level. You know what? No, let, let's just focus on getting Ross closer to leveling up. We can worry about them later. I did just focus on getting him to level 20. And then I can make him into the next unit. With Dazla here, it would be kind of weird to make him a berserker. Look at me just planning ahead. All right, got my formation down and we're ready to go after this jump cut. Okay, just doing a quick look to see who I even brought. This is like way after I've recorded the first part, but whatever, I think I'm ready. Let's go. I'm concerned for Ewan as well. I'll go with you. I hope he is safe. Nah, he's not looking too safe. Hey, w wait a moment. We can work this out. You, uh, aren't interested in talking, are you? Ah! Uh. Where'd all those freaks come from? I've got to get back and warn everyone. But 
I do wonder if grandmother is all right. So yeah, we need to save Ewan. All right, 32 enemies left here, Kit. Oh boy, all right. So who we got over here? I've... It has been a hot minute. Uh, Poison Claw, we gotta be careful there. You gotta... Mm, do you have the restore staff with you? You do, but you can't use it yet. Oh boy, just fantastic. Okay, um, well they can only move one at a time. You're gonna probably be in gargoyle range, so go ahead, equip that, and wait. Now. I really don't have to worry about that spider. Too much, at least. Will this put her at risk of... Nothing, really. Do you have a ranged weapon with you? You do have a javelin. Okay, great. Yeah, I'm gonna have to have you attack with the javelin. I... I really do like the idea that Vanessa decided to step it up once she saw Tana, like, shining. And let me just make sure, yes, yeah, Solid, you will be on. And all right. Wait, did I just change the setting? That's about right, okay. Now what else? Pirates can't climb mountains. Can they? Yeah, because then you'd be able to climb that one. All right, blast. Did I just say blast? What am I, British? Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Not quite strong enough yet. I kind of want to put Marissa there, but she will be in Lance range, and we can't have that. Honestly, just go ahead, Franz. Do your thing. Cool, good God. Oh, good God. There will be more opportunities for uh, Amelia to kill. No worries there. Okay, Spider will be on the move, and then I can just start mobilizing everybody else. Okay, plenty of experience to go around. It's a monster chapter. You really can use these to train people up. Ah, her dance. Which I'm probably about to switch off just for time purposes. I'm gonna be doing a pretty grindy strategy for something in particular on this map and it will involve her so yeah just gonna tone down a bit anybody you can heal because uh i need you to be able to use that restore staff just in case something pops off no all right no no just do something Spiders on the move. I don't like the damage that you're capable of doing to Tana, but I forgot that she has breached 30 HP on this file. So she will be all set and then some. Now, someone irresponsible could go ahead and save Ewan right now. Huh. Well, that, hmm. That was unexpected. Okay, well, um. Hi. 
Hello, how you doing? Ireland's chat. Axe Reaver? Okay, wow. Hello. Horse Slayer? Alright. Cool. Steel Lance? Yep. Ireland's and Javelin. Okay, great. Um. Mm-hmm. That changes things up a bit. Quite a bit indeed. Um, well, I'm just gonna go ahead and have you go right here and, uh, alright, well. Cool beans, cool, cool, cool beans. Um, that won't kill, but she will live. Mm hmm. Iron Lance, maybe? Alright, wow. Okay. Uh, could take out you, but that would put you, yep, in range of them, as well as them. And then get too close to him, and then... Oh, no, she'll be fine. Let's see if she can actually hit. Vanessa. She really is, like, on her tryhard grind to redeem herself. I don't know how to feel about that. Will you be safe under Arthur... I believe in you. You can't even hit them anyway. All right, great. Fair enough. And I'm conflating, like, items so much. I'm like, why don't you have a short bow? Oh, that's right. Different file. Uh, I'm just going to go for the shore money. There's no guarantee she'd be able to hit with that uh, steel bow. Oh, really, Arthur? Really, Arthur? Shouldn't be too surprised, though. Moth Duke's speed is really good. Hmm. What's your defense looking like, girl? Not quite iron wall, uh, so I am going to have to be a little careful. Oh yeah, especially since... The... The... The, um... Gargoyle will be attacking from mountain, but... I have no fear. Yeah, Erica's going to have to, like, assist with a kill here. If she could start gaining some HP, that would be amazing. Wait, let me just make sure... One, two, three, four, five, six... So that is your limit. Okay, great. Death Goyle is seven. Got it. Can you please get a critical? Thank you. Sometimes you just gotta ask nicely. Oh, then I could have danced for her instead and have her. Ah, oh, man. Oh wait, no, I did dance for her initially to even get her over there. I'm, I'm dumb. Okay, forgive me. Yeah, let's get you with some L fire. God, I love the sage attacks! Solid, really? Really, Bundu? Re really? Really and for truly? That's what we're doing right now. Okay. So, um, you are beginning to let me down a little. Yes, uh, that much... Please hit. Thank you. Oh uh, man, I really need to stop using the hatchet before I run out of uses, but... I mean... It's better than the hand axe. No, I do not want her to be knee-deep in gargoyle territory. 
but I can probably bait out the one with the horse slayer. Because apparently Pegasi, flying horses, don't count as horses. But no, that, that's a little too spicy right there. Um, mm, could have her attack one of them. Go for it. But on that note, I'm probably going to have to move... Oh my god, your strength is at 14. I'm going to have to move uh, Amelia ASAP. I have a feeling those gargoyles are going to try and zero in on her. And she does not have the movement. Yep. But a horse slayer, she'll be fine. Oh yeah, she's, she doesn't even really have the attack. Really? You're attacking twice. What? Wow, and you had the advantage. Okay, I'm not feeling this little predicament over here. <laughs> um, at all. Let me just go on back here, make sure that's equipped. Let them come to me. Let them come to me. You just equip the hand axe in case he wants to start something with you. Who's about to level up? Can you get him? I don't want you anywhere near him. Um, hmm. Why not? Oh boy. This will put her, like, in a better position to assist with the, um, gargoyles that are going to be flying over. Let me get you right here as well. Oh, boy. Alright, no. Use your brain, self. Hmm, hmm. Okay, for the time being, I'm going to go ahead and, uh... Disable Lara Shell's animations for a minute, too. Hey, Tetris leveled up! Alright. It's gonna be interesting to see who it tries to attack. Oh, I could have had her heal again. Do you have a staff? No, you don't. Why? You're a sage. Oh yeah, uh, I'm dealing with this over here. Go for it. Okay, Vanessa leveled up. Good, good. All right. That happened. All right, the spiders are nearing. And here come the gargoyles. Really? <laughs> now, for the fun, you cannot attack twice with that Amelia. What was that sound I made? A sound of disappointment, really. I'm mad. She attacked twice with the javelin. Though a javelin is heavier than an iron lance, but still. Wow, her HP really is pretty bad. Oh, 
so close. Alright, which one? Oh my goodness. Let me go for the Horse Slayer. Wow, Naomi, really? Like, that's not a lot of uh, experience. But I did get a Horse Slayer, so that's perfectly fine. Um... All right, no doubt in my mind that she'll be able to take this out. Tana is going straight beast mode, and I respect that, like, so much. What is your movement, by the way? Five. Oh, God. All right, we're going to have to uh, put somebody in front. Oh, yeah, duh. Just do this. Ross, please. I wanted you to get that critical hit on the first attack, but it, it's fine, it's fine. Better late than never. Alrighty. So yeah, we're good now. Well, Ross is about to level up. Franz can get the next kill. Gonna definitely need to heal Amelia, though. Might as well do this for some quick experience. Okay. And as for you, um, I'm just gonna, like, have you slowly go through here and destroy everything. So... Do I have anything to worry about up here? Okay. Like a skeleton using a ballista or something. You have Volinary on you? Okay. Just equip the iron and wait. That is a lot of damage. That is too. Okay. Why did the spider move up? It's really going after Nessa? Yes, please. All right. She really trying to overcompensate for what happened earlier. I, I can't be replaced by Tana. I gotta prove my worth. Oh my god. Dodged again. She really did go try hard mode. All right, Slim Lance then. Now. Could advance slowly, but where's the fun in that? So we'll just do a little of this, make sure that they cannot get to her. Genuinely hope I don't come to regret this. She should be fine, famous last words. Then move you ever so slightly, heal you. 
so close. Erica can't even move. Yeah, if I move anyone else, they're gonna be within attack range. Go for it. Okay, I'm genuinely stunned you hit both of those. Tana popping off. Okay, Marissa, we need to have a talk. Yeah, they really going after Vanessa. Tana. Are you okay? Are, are, are you thrown off your game because of Vanessa? Don't worry, Vanessa's not gonna take your spot, especially with strength like that. See? Oh my gosh, she just got a... Vanessa, this is not gonna make me apologize to you for half the stuff I said. Okay, this is a travesty. Tana is poisoned. Need to do something about that. First, we're gonna kill this thing. All right, Marissa leveled up. Eh. Not all that good of a level up, to be honest. I'd rather not have her fight both. Or even one, to be completely honest. So yeah, go ahead, equip that. Is this going to raise your weapon level, please? No, not quite. Wrong button. She's getting closer. So we'll just keep healing every turn for easy experience. It's a very thin pass. Hmm. Yeah, I'd rather her not get attacked by spiders. We can just leave her there for right now. Probably should have had her use a Volunary, to be honest. Okay. Anybody really about to level up here so I can take them out? All right, name me. Just go for it. Ugh, so close. So I can move you more out in the open now. Okay. Like, no real clue what I'm doing. Just moving everybody, like, one space. 
I say like one space, genuinely moving them like, I, I said like again, God, force of habit. Generally moving them over, or literally moving them over one space. I can't talk today, all right? I'm sorry. Yeah, you can't get me now, can you? Idiots. Nice dodge, kid. Now. Who gets the kill? Go for it, Amelia. You're about to level up. And it'll be legendary. Well, I actually could have had her up there dealing with them. She would not have taken any damage. Okay. One HP. I'm not mad. I'm not I'm not livid. I'm not angry. Upset, disgusted, disappointed, furious. No, just It's the circle of life. Doesn't even make sense. I don't even I'm just disgusted. <laughs> anyway, let's just wait. You can really just play this all kinds of patient. As the spiders mobilize. Honestly, I have so much faith in Tana. Maybe I shouldn't. Tana, come on. What? You're better than this. I don't know what's wrong with her, but it's making me sad. She's supposed to be a monster and unstoppable killing machine and she's missing and I don't know, man. Hmm. What's your range? One, two, three, one, two, three, four, five. Ross will be out of the range. Wanted to make sure. Fine, go ahead, weaken them, Namie. Got her using steel now. There we go. All right, Namie, I see you there. I see you. Not trying to be outdone by Ainz. I, I respect that. To be fair, Erica has not got too many kills. We do need to rectify that. Seated right next to a uh, giant spider because no fear. Okay, I'm actually uh, frightened by how much damage it is capable of doing. 
Uh, if it hits, it one-shots Erica, and we can't have that now, can we? Please, miss. Okay. Um, is she in danger? Just kill Erica. <gasps> Come on, man. Okay, this is fine. Hey, at least we're finally dodging now. Oh, they are too. We're actually dealing with competent enemies, guys. The spider force is rolling deep, but Tana is over her poison. Yeah, I'm actually just gonna wait and see what he does. Because they are, like, seriously showing me that just because I have a really good chance of dodging something doesn't mean I will. Oh, that was not a full heal, should have went mend. Okay. It is what it is. Go on, Erica. Dodge the poison claw, please. Very glad she did, by the way. Okay. Now for the kill. Get a critical hit, please. Thank you. That hurts. Tethys has not danced yet. Just gonna see if I can get Amelia up here to deal like any kind of damage. Don't know why I'm bothering after that poor showing with the level up. Okay. So I need to eradicate this monster as soon as possible. Is Amelia looking nice? Nice, okay. Honestly, to leave no room for error, I'm going with something that will guarantee me a 100% chance of attacking or hitting. Alright. Everything else is same as it ever was.
Okay. Oh, you're in attack range of him. Oh, you still have the killer axe equipped. Ugh. Okay, um, have we all just forgotten how to dodge? Is that just an alien concept now in the world of Fire Emblem? The act of dodging? All right, Vanessa, you... She's just back to her old self. I, I have proven enough now to go back to being useless. Yay! I can attack twice with a heavy spear. Oh my god. We're doing this for novelty. I forgot she's incapable of avoiding poison attacks. She did level up. <laughs> Just showing off. It's like, oh, that's what Vanessa got? Here's what I got maxed out speed at level 12. Vanessa, what you got? You ain't got that. And you would have had. <laughs> She's level 12 and got 15 strength. You only have this strength because I used an energy ring or body ring or whatever it's called. You're lame. Hmm. Just going ahead doing the public service that Lara Show provides. You kind of need assistance as well. I'm going to send one of my flyers, um, and by one of my flyers, I mean Tana. up until the mountains directly above us. Everyone else should just mm, take a break and rest. After Tethys dances for Arthur. Okay. Let's go. Not mean to do that. Let's go. No one's moving, huh? All right. So just equip iron for now. She's saving the... Oh, there we go. I was about to say she's saving the men's staff for a rainy day. Right now? We about to have her uh, fix that poison. Good stuff. So if I go right there... Those two will be able to attack me. You'll probably go in for the kill, too. Okay, not gonna lie, kinda lost track of what I was doing. Um, checking your range? I don't know anymore. Well, first things first, I'm not attacking 
any of them are rather visiting those houses until these guys are taken care of. But I will also put you right here. Just in case. Franz crawled so that we could walk. Nope, did not mean to do that, and then you can go right over there. Alright. Slow moving map, mostly because of like the thin corridors. Wow, one hit, huh? Alright. Go on, Ross. They are actually going. Well, you couldn't attack Ross. She can one shot him. Tana, you don't need to prove anything. Your level up was amazing. You don't need to do this. They're already dead. I wonder. I mean, not close to leveling up or anything, but don't want him near you. Sorry, zoned out again. Um, I want to get Franz up in there without worrying about... I just want to avoid this dude right there. He looks like he means business. You can hide out in the mountains just in case. Don't know what would possibly come up, but you never know. Who do I heal? Oh, okay. I'm up here like, wait, who had less HP? But I moved Arthur there so we could dance for him. Yeah, you can't have it all, Larishal. Alright. Not bad. Because it's more survivability. Never a bad thing. That's a good thing. Hit him with that lightning. Okay. Ah, so close. Good lord. So who am I baiting out over here? This is all still a work in progress, by the way. I can't believe monsters have appeared here in the realm of the great dragon. What is this world coming to? This staff should help you to or should help to protect you against the beasts. Please travel safely. Hey, we got a barrier staff. Actually, pretty good. Um, see so yeah, what a barrier staff does is increase magic resistance of adjacent allies briefly. Not useful here, but oh man, is it going to be useful? Minor spoilers. Okay, it is gonna take them like eight years to get up here where everybody else is. Yep, oh, you went for Ross instead of um, Franz. Brave. Or stupidity. <laughs> Quite frankly, sometimes it's hard to tell.
Just trying to figure out. I'm back in min max mode. It's what I do. I'm gonna give Amelia one more chance. I hope she won't make me regret this. There's a very real chance she will. But one can hope not. She's done it. I also was not paying attention to her health. I mean, it's not the worst, but still, you. I'm, I'm kind of expecting way better level ups for my uh, trainees now. And that's not happening. Oh yeah, and I need to visit the other house. Making sure there are any more houses about. I mean, we got the vendor right there, but that's not a house. Alright then, save the lad. You were one of the people with my teacher, weren't you? You think I can fight at your side? I can use my or the magic my teacher taught me. Well, what do you say? And that's Ewan. He is a uh, trainee in the arts of magic. So you're gonna have to be very careful with him. You don't want him to get swarmed by too many enemies. Well, technically none at all, considering, uh... Wow. Wow! T w whatever The disgust caused me to lose my train of thought. You don't want him to get surrounded because he's a mage. It means he's weak. Some of that ilk. All right, so we got one more steel axe dude right there. Uh, they actually drop way easier than I initially thought. Not that I'm complaining. Either you have an axe reaver. Not this file. Okay, fine. Okay. Now I'm gonna play it safe with the Steel Axe, dude. Okay, zoned out for a third time. That mostly means that, um, I should try not to, uh, record the next map after this like I initially planned to do. <laughs> Hmm. I could start putting some stuff in the range of them. Which I desperately want to do. But I should still play it safe. Oh yeah, I was putting you up here for backup. Honestly, with steel swords... I can have Vanessa equip the Slim Lance. 
and that way she can weaken them without killing them and then someone else can get the experience. Wow. Franz, you did not need to do that. It was gonna be someone else's experience. Oh, really? Mm-hmm. 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 Okay. Change of plan. Tana and Vanessa about to tag team these gargoyles. Actually, no, I'm better off waiting for them to get near me. I do want to get Ewan as far away as possible, though. Well, regardless. I can still lure him out. And let me start getting ready for those, uh, those gargoyles. Like, why attack them there when I can wait for them to be on solid ground? If they'll even get to solid ground. You got another gargoyle over there. I can wait, because I'm going to have a lot to deal with over on this side. You're not moving. That's interesting. And very unexpected. I do want to get Ewan, like, away from them, though. Are you going to dance for someone? Okay, maybe I will have to have them on, um... Blocking duty. Okay, you're doing a lot. Why do you have the javelin equipped? Oh my god, well it didn't even matter. Wait a minute. Oh, okay, I was like, why is Francis HP like 22? He should be doing more than that, like, oh, because he got hurt. Me stupid. All right. We are not in good attack position for much of anything. Okay. Um. Bit of a problem here. A pretty big problem here.
S someone's gonna get hit by a javelin. That's gonna be set in stone. So one over. Marissa, I want away. La Rochelle is going to be fine. If he gets attacked by a javelin, he gets attacked by a javelin. I could use Franz to guide them away, but he's strong enough where he can probably kill. Let me just make sure. Only Franz, Vanessa, and Tana are open. Franz, Vanessa, and Tana. Franz... No, Ross, Vanessa, and Tana. And you are more than likely going to attack Arthur. There's really not much else I can do here to prepare. Please do not let this backfire. Okay, we're good then. We're good. So that means at most, because of where he's standing, Tana's only going to get attacked once. Oh, okay, and then this means that uh, Arthur is going to be safe. But then the dude with the javelin is probably going to attack uh, Vanessa. So they just don't want any of the uh, Tana smoke. Can't say I blame them. Would you really want that smoke? I wouldn't. Okay. So, who wants to level up? Go ahead, Arthur. Make it good, please. I want to have good magic users. <sighs> Why? What have I done? to deserve the things that are happening to me. Oh Lord. Nice though. Hmm. Huh. Why not? Oh, double critical hit all the way across the sky. Wow, so intense, Marissa.
I'm just beyond disappointed. I really am, just nothing works out in your boy's favor, just you know, the enemy's doing whatever, and units not dodging, but at least I can rely on Tana to kill, but the level ups, giving bad stats, just, why? Oh, you're not a mover? None of the remaining things are movers. Well, this changes a lot. Also, let me go ahead and make sure that you're going to be on attack mode. I mean, if he's not going to move, then I might as well have some fun with this. At least I hope he doesn't start moving after this. Okay. Not bad. Now. Wait, did I ever have anybody in his range? Yeah, I think I did. We're about to have Tana in his range. Because I don't even know what I want to do with uh, Vanessa anymore, like, it's just sad at this point, all it really makes me want to do is cry, wonder where I went wrong, I thought I was being a good tactician, lord knows I tried my best. Oh, three enemies left. Let's wait it out. I forgot what you're carrying on you. Halberd and a steel bow. Kind of tempted to have him switch to the steel bow so I can get a free Halberd. But it's not that deep. Okay, one level up. Didn't really do much, but I will take it. <clears throat> Why do I even bother? Just... Anyone y'all about to level up? 12 and... Even nice and... 52. 39, I'm just looking at the experience points needed. Okay, an obligatory zone out, out of the way. And I think I was actually in mid, like, sentence that time. Yeah, oh, ooh, Tana, nice. But yeah, I don't know why, I'm just, like, super tired right now. Oh, well. It is what it is. Teach her how to dance. And we wait. All right, Ewan, finish the. Oh, no, it's not going to finish it off. I mean, if the bosses don't move, then I might as well hook them up, you know? A little sad he can actually attack twice on him, though. Mostly because if he could only attack once, that would have meant, like, the fact that he'd only be able to just keep willing them down on every, like, switch of fate, or every phase switch, and that means he would level up more often. But this is a worthy substitute. 
Honestly, had I not finished off uh, literally everything, I could have had him. Uh, that's where I'm looking for here. Finish off some of the enemies so that he could get to level 10 in a single chapter. But that went well enough. Okay, that's better. Might as well dance whenever an opportunity arises. Alright. Vendor time, thank God. Um... Just an extra fire. Loot, lightning and shine, eh. Heal staff, yes. Men staff, yes. Store staff, eh. Volunary, yes. All right. That should be enough. Hmm, elixir, nope. I'm good on the rest of all of that. And now we only have the boss to worry about. And I'm gonna have Ewan do it. So, uh, bear with me as I get him up to that spot. Okay, so he's not weak enough, or strong enough, rather. Oh my god. Please give him the strength. First he was at four. Okay. Oh my god. Now, the other option is I can just keep having him attack to do zero damage until his weapon level increases. Which is not ideal. Hmm. Well, first let me make sure it even works. Just a little before the E. Yeah, okay, he gets experience. Not a lot. Nothing worthwhile. Okay, well. Shouldn't have killed everything. Um, this raises some problems. Sorry, just trying to think on how I'm going to go through this, but no time to think, just heal. We'll come up with something. By hook or by crook, we will come up with something here. And it does not involve Marissa. What can I do, Franz? 
Ooh, the Halbert, the, oh yeah, no, 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 no. Franz is not going to do a dang thing. Uh, hmm. Go for it. <laughs> what's the what what what's the speed looking like here? He about to get nasty. Cause once he switches to that steel bow, it's on and popping. Missed. Stupid idiot. Okay. I guess I can let Erica get the kill then. Cause Marissa ain't doing a damn thing. Oh, she can probably do a grand total of 12 damage if she gets uh, both critical hits. Does Tana genuinely have the most strength on anyone on my team right now? Oh my God. She surpasses Ross? Oh, okay, well, magic, but she surpasses Ross and Franz. What? That would be just enough. Oh, that mercs him. Okay, anybody like super close to leveling up, like where one attack can put you over the edge? Doesn't look to be the case. Last minute heal. Genuinely was trying to just find someone who uh, La Rochelle could heal. All right, let's beat him. Could min max, but I don't feel like moving people out of his range. There we go. Plus, I should probably shoot for like one or two levels per video for Erica. But we got a Halbert. It's pretty great. We win. Sala, is that you, Sala? Tell me, is the great dragon well? I'm sorry, Elder. I searched to the west, but I found nothing. Is that so? Hmm? Who's that with you? I am Ainz, Prince of Fralia. The circumstances of our journey have led us here. We would like to pass through. Please! Hmm. Who of Kyrpel have turned away f from the world outside? Or we of Kyrpel have turned away from the world outside? It still affects you, though. World domination still affects you. The Ray Dragon alone holds all our honor and esteem. In this place, princes and paupers are equals. Do you s have a problem with that? No, I understand. Hmm. Well then, be welcomed as guests in our homes. I see some of you are injured. You should use this rock moss. We have little beyond what we need, but we will prepare food and... Or prepare food, not a food, and bedding. You can rest as long as you like. We've no wish to trouble you. We just as soon pass straight through. Don't let your pride drive away or drive you to foolishness. 
That girl there looks like she's ready to collapse any moment. She's ill from the height of the mountain. Sally, prepare some tea for the last. Thank you, Elder. Call me Grandmother Child. That is what the villagers call me. Uh, Grandmother, may I ask you a question? This great dragon. Ah, the inquisitiveness of youth. Come, lass, listen to my words. The great dragon is a blessing, one that watches over all mankind. Why, in days long past, when the Demon King appeared... Demon King? Are you speaking of the Legend of the Sacred Stones? The hero Grado used the power of the five sacred stones to defeat and seal away. No, no, that's not right at all. Ah, how quickly did mankind forget its debt to the great dragon. To hear the story now, one would think humans alone brought about our victory. That is a gross mistelling of the fate. Or tale. Good God. Yeah, I definitely need sleep after this. Only through the great dragon's strength could the demon king be sealed away. The great dragon and the demon king? Mankind may have forgotten its debt, but the great dragon never forgets. It watches over the bones of the demon king in darkling woods. It keeps the demon king's dark brood from swarming the world of men. The great dragon's vigilance alone has kept us safe from their blind rage. Is that so? I'm... I'm sorry, I never knew. Hmph, <laughs> you don't need to know everything, but you should remember that. Yet, grandmother... We encountered those creatures on the way here. And they have begun to appear in the lands we live in as well. What does this mean? Ah, you must have seen the effects of the omen that has appeared in the south. There is an energy there that has fouled the air and darkened the sky. The great dragon left Darkling Woods and went south to investigate. We of the village wish to protect the great dragon and so I sent my grandson. Sala along as well. Sorry, the commas there threw me off. But they became embroiled in battle, and the great dragon disappeared. Since that time, there has been no sign of the great dragon either here or abroad. We grew worried and directed Sala to look for any trace of that great dragon. I'm worried that the source of that foul energy may be responsible. A foul energy? From the south? Mur said something similar to this, too. Is the great dragon you speak of one of the Manichetti? Manichetti? How dare you speak so of the great dragon? I I'm sorry. But if you've seen the noble Mur, perhaps I can proceed more quickly. You see, our great dragon took the form of Mistress Mur in her travels. And you tell me that you have seen the great dragon yourself, lass? Yes. Mur was with my brother. What? Where is this brother of yours? He leads a force of men against Grado. Mur rides beside him. Sala, this is urgent. You must leave for Grado at once and rescue the great dragon. Understood. I will. Oh, where are you off to? If you're going to Grado, the swiftest route takes you through Jahana. It would be to your advantage to join us in our journey for a time. It's far safer than being on your own. You have a point. Mistress Erica, protecting the great dragon is my duty. Please allow me to travel with you on the road ahead. We are in your debt, matron. Not at all. All of our guidance comes from the great dragon. Sally? Yes, I know. The road to Jahana lies here. Grandmother, thank you so much for everything. I know you'll help the great dragon, but please look after Salai as well. He's not very personable, but he's the only grandchild I have. And with that, we're done for today. Next time we're going to Mark Hamill Cannon. Oh my god, yeah. I need sleep right now. I am very sorry for like how awful that part was. Nobody died, so I guess it's not all awful, but yeah, just a lot of like instances of me zoning out, almost uh, dozing off, and it was just not good. Not good. Not good. The lack of sleep is catching up to me. 
Oh boy. But yeah, that's gonna be it for today. Thank you all for watching. Have a great day. See you next time for some more Let's Play Fire Emblem The Sacred Stizones. Goodbye. <laughs>